The French company Mirio is all set to sign a collaboration agreement with Hyderabad-based HC Robotics Private Limited to establish the production of advanced gimbals for the Indian Armed Forces. The DRDO is looking to indigenize many components of the M53 engine of Mirage 2000 fighter jet. The Indian Navy chief has said that Navy has contracted two Hermes 900 mil UAVs that will be manufactured in India under transfer of technology with Elbit systems with 60% indigenous content that will be inducted by February 2024. The Border Security Force plans to deploy a Marine Battalion of over 1,100 trained personnel, a squadron of 40 drones and 14 all-terrain vehicles along the India-Bangladesh border. The Deputy Project Director of Twin Engine Deck-based fighter program has said that the Aeronautical Development Agency is working in close collaboration with the Navy, and the first TED-BF prototype is expected by 2028. Japan's Kawasaki Heavy Industry has unveiled a new diesel-electric submarine concept with high-stealth technology carbon dioxide removal technology and improved maneuverability, and interestingly, the vertical launch systems would be fitted between the sail and the bow. The Spanish Navy has commissioned its first S-80 Plus class submarine, that has drawn interest from the Indian Navy, as Navantia has offered the same S-80 Plus submarine with next-generation AIP system under the Project 75i, alongside extensive crew training technology transfer, and support in building domestic submarine manufacturing capabilities. Facing stiff competition from Germany, Navantia has offered the S-80 Plus submarine at significantly lower price per unit, and officials have said that the cost difference is substantial, potentially putting pressure on Germany to revise its bid, or risk losing the tender to the Spanish contender. A single firing unit of Akash missile system simultaneously engaged and destroyed four unmanned targets during the recent exercise Astra Shakti 2023, making India the first country to demonstrate the capability of engaging four targets simultaneously by command guidance using a single firing unit. Officials have said that four targets were coming from same direction in a close formation and were split to attack from multiple directions simultaneously and four Akash missiles were launched to successfully engage the targets at its maximum range of 30 kilometers. India has told the US that the Strikers Caterpillar C7 Plus 350 horsepower engine is inadequate for operating in high-altitude regions, as engines can lose 30% power due to thin air in high-altitude Ladakh sector and the striker maneuver short-range air defense variant offered to India would require to carry significant weight, that will further stress the engine. To address these concerns, the US has now offered an upgraded version of the striker equipped with the Cummins-developed advanced combat engine, that boasts 750 horsepower and offers superior power density and heat rejection compared to the current engine. The Indian Air Force has announced that it has carried out the successful firing trials of the Summer Air Defense Missile System during exercise Astra Shakti 2023, that has been designed and developed in-house by a unit under the Air Force's Maintenance Command. It successfully achieved firing trial objectives in different engagement scenarios, and engaged aerial threats at 25 km with missiles operating at a speed range of 2.5 Mach. Today's top 3 comments.